The big dig out has begun after the first blizzard of 2022 finally moved out of the New England states. The bomb cyclone brought wind gusts clocked at 134 kilometers per hour to Massachusetts coastal communities. Waves crashed over seawalls and battered homes. Streets officially flooded. Tens of thousands of people were left without power as temperatures fell below zero. This is where the dangerousness sets in. You cannot have people in their homes without heat for any length of time. Thousands of flights have been canceled or delayed for a second day. New York's busy LaGuardia Airport looked like a ghost town Sunday. The storm dumped snow in places that rarely see the white stuff, including Rehoboth, Delaware, where U.S. President Joe Biden has his summer home, and Cape Charles, Virginia. Certainly for me, this is enough snow for the rest of my life. But the weekend storm was welcomed by many. Some skiers enjoyed the quiet roads. Others took part in a massive snowball fight. A couple from Rhode Island even went ahead with their outdoor wedding. I now pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> Not even a blizzard, gusty winds and bitter temperatures could stop this happy event. Jennifer Johnson, Global News, Washington.